Uh, you're in a relationship now with Dan Grattan, is it, for, for the last... Dan uh, McGrattan, number, yeah. Dan McGrattan, excuse me, for a number of years now. And um, you never got married. No. Would you ever consider getting married? Uh, not really at this stage, Ryan. Uh, to be honest, not really at any stage. Although I did, I did um, meet a woman quite recently whom I knew vaguely from when I was in my early 20s. Mm -hmm. And uh, um, she has disposed of a number of husbands. And, and, uh, <laughs> and she said to me, only with the, with the pity of the much married, and you never even got a husband. And how do you respond to such a comment? Well, I said I borrowed the odd one, but I always sent them back in. <laughs> In very good nick, better than I got them in. Of course, this, is in, <laughs> this was entirely untrue. Right? No, 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 naturally. No, but the girl has to say something. Yeah, you know? just to put them back in their box, I suppose. Uh, but you've been proposed to a few times, haven't you? I have been, I suppose, occasionally <laughs> over the years. <laughs> Here and there, I mean, I, I'm, I'm sure that you're propositioned every day of the week yourself. Yeah, 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 so yeah. what's the odd proposal here yeah, and there? Yeah. But uh, as, a, as, a, as a spinster, you know, I wouldn't claim for a moment to have seen too many um, men on their knees, God help us. But I have to say, uh, I did once see Brian Dobson on his knees, and it was one of the most beautiful sights I've ever seen. Well, now, you have us in the palm of your hand, Anne, and with that in mind, you'd better explain that, especially for the Dobson family at large. Oh, absolutely, and rightly so. It was actually the, the night that uh, the late Pope John Paul II died, and uh, he had been ill for, you know, obviously quite long a long time. time. Yeah. And uh, so, it, it, you know, we were... It sounds a terrible thing to say, but that's the nature of news. We, we were waiting. He was, he was gravely ill, and he was going to die. And so we were kind of in a state of readiness. Mm -hmm. But on, on the night that he actually died, I was doing the nine o'clock news Saturday night, and Brian had been on quite an extended program. And when I was going into studio, he was just about to head off on his bike home. Mm -hmm. And about eight, nine, seven minutes to nine, we got word that the Pope had died. So obviously everything changed. But my own thought was, primarily because at times like that, I'm I'm sure you would agree with me, you actually become incredibly self-centred because you think, oh, that's very sad, what am I going to do? And, uh, and so I started and just wrote a headline of some sort and did it to camera because obviously everything else was, you know, at that stage. Uh, we, you know, events had over, yes. uh, uh, passed by the, the, the VTs and so on. And, uh, and I had a, a cobble together, a lead in, and we come to the first VT, thank God, and I see Brian before we get to it, I see him inside the door on his knees. He hadn't left the building, as they say. Great. And so he was on his, he was in, he was, he was just ready to crawl across the floor to, uh, to get into to, the seat. I never was as glad to see well, a human that was, being. Well, that was some commitment. And yeah, and there was no proposal at all. Not none there. Why was I glad to see him? <laughs> well, do you think you'll ever settle down, as they say? Oh, well, I might now later on. Um, but <laughs> I, I, my, my ambition at the moment, apart from uh, uh, being happy and trying to be good, is to live long enough and for the government, whichever it is, not to do away with the free travel. OK. That is my dearest wish, because I'm not a driver. Yeah. And I use the train a lot, and I would love to get the free travel. And perhaps then, <laughs> after I get that and I get to expand my horizons by being to Cork and Galway every five minutes, I might think about marriage. But sure, there's no rush.